Engine trouble is the last thing anyone wants to deal with, but it does occur. A bent engine valve is one of the more troublesome issues that can cause headaches. What are the symptoms of a bent engine valve, and how severe is the problem? Given that the engine valves are such an important motor component, it is critical to resolve this issue as soon as possible. In this video, we examine the typical signs of bent engine valves. This guide also demonstrates how to check for bent engine valves. It's the Car Problems YouTube channel. Subscribe and let's get started. Check engine light. To guarantee peak performance, modern cars continuously monitor every sensor in the engine. In the event that a sensor fails or a parameter deviates from the acceptable range, your dashboard's check engine light will turn on. A check engine light will surely illuminate if any engine valves are bent. An OBD2 scanner can be used to search for trouble codes associated with the air fuel mixture. Trouble codes may indicate misfires or an incorrect air fuel mixture, but they won't directly show that an engine valve is bent because engine valves aren't electronic. Low compression. Compression is the term for the pressure that builds up inside the cylinder as the engine runs. Compression imbalance is often caused by bent engine valves. Fuel does not burn correctly when this pressure is too low because it interferes with the combustion process. Low compression results from the bent engine valve's inability to close firmly, which compromises the cylinder head seal. A lack of power and other performance problems arise from the compression being broken by air or exhaust escaping. During a compression test, you should inspect your engine valves to make sure they are not leaking if you observe low compression. Lack of power. Bent engine valves almost always cause a loss of power. In many cases, these power issues stem from a drop in cylinder pressure caused by a damaged valve. When the valve does not close properly or sits where it should, the combustion mixture is thrown off. Furthermore, power issues may result from the engine running rich to compensate for the problems caused by the bent valve. In either case, it must be repaired. Otherwise, the problem will worsen over time. Excessive oil consumption. Engine valves must be lubricated to function properly. The valve seal lubricates the valve stem with oil as it moves. However, the valve seal prevents oil from entering the cylinder. When the valve bends, the seal may wear or become damaged. These broken seals allow oil to enter the combustion chamber. This defect causes an excessive amount of oil to burn. It can also affect how the engine runs and damage the catalytic converter if not addressed promptly. If you see blue smoke coming from your exhaust pipe, it could be due to a bent engine valve, causing the valve seal to leak. Shaking engine. It is well known that bent engine valves alter the engine's operation. The motor may begin to shake as a result of misfires if a valve is harmed by something like a broken timing belt. Driving at slower speeds or while idling may cause you to notice this more frequently. You may be able to drive for a brief period of time, depending on how severely the valve is damaged, but badly damaged valves can completely stop the engine from running. Engine backfires. The way fumes exit the cylinder is impacted when an exhaust valve is bent. To guarantee that the proper amount of pressure is always present, the exhaust valves must open and close at precise times. A bent exhaust valve can become misaligned. Additionally, it might not close properly. This flaw results in an exhaust leak that alters the fuel's combustion. The ECU may overcompensate by altering the amount of fuel supplied to the cylinder when it detects an issue. Unburned fuel seeps into the exhaust when the cylinder is running rich, producing a popping or backfire sound. How to test bent engine valves the best way to check for a bent engine valve would be to physically inspect the valve and remove the cylinder head. Compression tests and leak down tests are useful because most people don't want to deal with this much work. You can quickly determine how much compression each cylinder produces by using a compression test. It's an easy way to check the engine's performance. You will proceed to the leak down test if you discover that one cylinder is low. You can use this diagnostic to determine when the engine is leaking air. The spark plug hole is connected to the leak down test. Following that, the crankshaft rotates until the cylinder reaches the compression stroke. At this point, you can hear the engine rushing air out. You are probably dealing with a bent intake valve if the air is coming from the intake. Conversely, a bent exhaust valve is the source of air coming from the exhaust. Air leaving these areas, though, could also indicate that the valves are simply accumulating carbon, which results in a poor seal. If you are unsure, you may need to have a qualified mechanic perform additional diagnostics. Hope this info is useful to you. If so, please press the like button and subscribe to the channel.